There's the intestine, there's the esophagus, there's the fourth anus. Bro, do you think that he actually comes like that for everyone or is it just me? They go on this bloke thinks he's a YouTuber. Watch what I do to him. A pig's brain, eh? That's the scariest of all brains. Uh, it's numbing. Yeah, it's numbing. It's full numbing. Instantly when I bit it, it was like anesthetic. I'll save that for the old Chinese followers, eh? All right, everyone. Today's episode is sponsored by Culture Kings. They've given me a code to give you. Code Spanion, 10% off anything in their store. Jump on their website. Anything you buy at the, at the bottom, they're gonna say, choose a code, chuck in Spanion, you get 10% off. Look at their clothes, boys. I've been to their store, I walked around, gun clothes. And look, I like plain stuff, but it's not only plain stuff. Like I told you, they got mad Nordica tracksuits. They got mad stuff, brother. Check the website. And boys, you know, they sell ASICs. They do. Look at the ASICs they got, brother. They got the new, they got the new Quantums. They got these in many colors too. They got them in black and silver, black and gold, all red. Proper mad quantums. They got heaps of stuff anyway. Go on their website, check it out. Top clothing store, use code SPANIAN, 10% off. That's it, let's oge. All right, everybody, welcome back to another episode of It's All Eats. We're in Chinatown in Haymarket, City City. Spicy joint, spicy joint. It's a Sichuan Chinese restaurant. Very, very popular amongst all the um, Chinese people. Not a place um, I heard from the owner's daughter. It's not really where Westerners go, um, but amongst the, the Chinese people, this place palms. We'll suss it out. I heard all the food is spicy, so, you know, let's oj, baba. Hey, Royce, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, good, good. This is your dad's restaurant? Yeah, it's my dad's Nice, thank you for having me. Where am I sitting? I feel special, I'm in the only VIP. You say this place pumps, like, but we all, like Chinese people, eh? Hey, no social media presence, not many um, Aussies, no Westerners getting in here. Oh, uh, I mean, we do get like a couple wild people that want to yeah, come yeah. try it out. Yeah. They get scared away from the food, but to be honest, like once you eat this, you're going to realize like, wow. This what, because it's spicy? Yeah, spicy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's you know, actually people not that like, spicy. It's not? Oh, well, we'll see about that. Yeah. I'm a spice professional, I'm no, telling I'm you straight. Spice. Show me what you got, yeah. show me what you got. So this is our cold chicken in sesame oil. Um, so this is about, served cold? Served cold, yeah. Oh, a gun. You get a bit tripped out that it's cold, but yeah. there's a lot of dishes on our menu that are cold dishes. That oil looks lethally hot. It, is that like chili oil or not? Yeah, so <laughs> we have a secret recipe to all our chili yep, in the yep. kitchen. Yeah. Alright, eats. Oh. That's lovely. That's not Good spicy. Not spicy. That's though, not, yeah. spicy. not spicy. <laughs> yeah. Nah, that's it's gone. Spicy, though, right? Which is crazy, yeah. That's lovely. It's a spin out. How it's cold, but it's actually lovely. The oil, when you look at the oil, it's like maroon. It looks like you're gonna die if you touch it. You know what I mean? The type of stuff don't get it near your face. But it's actually not that spicy. Obviously, like I said, the sesame flavor to it. Lovely, but that's hectic. No wonder it's popular. What's this? This is Shengdu noodles. We've got chicken on the top. Yeah. We've got egg. Chili oil Special and, chili and oil. noodles done yep. into noodles done. Little, it's in. little swirls in the shape of a star. I'm impressed with your chopstick skills. Yeah. Noodle fan. I oh, know yeah. my name's Rice, but noodles for me. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Like, good noodles. <laughs> this is also going to shock you a bit. It's cold, but it just hits. Yeah, yeah, I've seen. I, yeah. I was thinking that. It's another cold dish. I've never had anything that tastes even similar to that in yeah, Chinese food before. That's hectic. It's so unique. This Sichuan, Sichuan yes. North China. North China, yep. Hey, see, I know, you know. I didn't just Google that before we got here, I knew. Lucky I've done a mad session today. I've done a leg session. Let's go, we're feeding the quads, let's oge. Another super, super famous one of ours. Yeah. It's a sliced fish in sweet and sour soup. Yep. Again, I've never seen anything even similar to it. When you did, you get camera porn of this? There's peppercorns in there, so they are spicy. Red and green, red, green, and white peppercorns. Wow. So the red isn't going to shock you. It's the actual corns that are going to shock your mouth. No way. I like that numbing flavor. Full of chili, full of pepper. 
I'm about to die. <laughs> Whoa. That, it tastes hectic. That's <laughs> mega. That's hot. Uh, it's numbing. Yeah, it's numbing. I like that. What the fuck? Yeah. It's full numbing. I swear to God, instantly when I bit it, it was like anesthetic. It's like my tongue has this numbing, almost like buzzing. You know when you're a kid, right? Nine volt batteries, and you, and you get two ends, and you put it on your tongue, and it's like, like that. It feels like that right now. And what, this is fish? It's full of pepper, I'm scared. Wow. This is intense. This is like there's a punch on in my mouth. Whoa. That pepper thing is like, that's, that's, it's so overwhelming. I don't think a lot of people could handle that, to be honest. I think most people, unless you're from Northern China, and this is like most people you walk in here, you're not gonna be able to cop that. Look how many peppers. Have a look. There's more chili in there than chicken. <laughs> now, is this how it comes out to everyone? Yeah. All right, you're not thinking in the back there, Judy's can, he's on camera. We say he wants to come here filming Judy's can. <laughs> Crispy fried chicken, huh? Peanuts, garlicky, the first, first dish that's had like a, a strong garlic flavor and has a strong chili flavor. Although it's not like, like I don't mean in a burning sense, I mean in a, a flavor sense. This one you can taste a lot of chili, it tastes mad. I mean, with Chinese people, we eat weird things, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not weird to me, but I can I can understand why they'd be weird to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Someone that's not Chinese, like yeah. intestines, which I'll definitely be serving for you. Let's go. <laughs> oh, look how much chili's in there. Yeah, what is that? <laughs> yeah, they're setting you up for sure. Bro, they, they, that, you think that, that actually <laughs> comes like that for everyone, or is it just me? Yeah, I they go, and this bloke thinks he's a YouTuber. Watch what I do to him. Why is chili in food? Yeah. It's the food of the gods. I'm not out of my waters here. No, my background's Spanish, but I have chili on everything except for ice cream. Chili, it's legitimately addictive. And it's been shown, it releases like endorphins. You get a feeling from chili. And it, I swear to God, it's addictive. I can barely eat without chili. If you give me something like even a pack of noodles, if it's not hot and spicy Thai, if there's any piece of meat and it doesn't have Tabasco, it doesn't even have master food chili sauce, like I can barely eat it. I don't know what it is, but I definitely understand their affinity for chili. It's 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 a worldwide thing too, you know what I mean? It is eggplant with mincemeat. Oh yum. I love eggplant. Eggplant and minced meat, eh? Mm -hmm. mm. That's it's good. It's back from the, the the chili. This one's almost not chili. Sweet. This is nice. I'm sure this will be more popular with the, the Aussies. This stuff, you gotta understand, you're supposed to be eating this on rice. I'm just taking a full strength, you know what I mean? It's like sipping cordial straight out the bottle, mate. Ain't no water here, but I'm having no rice here, lad. Let's oge. That's the only rice here. <laughs> Ain't no rice here, you know what I mean? Oof. This is our famous lamb chops. Oh, Which lovely. Of course. Yeah. I love lamb. It's my favorite meat straight out. Yeah. Ho, 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 ho. Oh. Lamb is the full universal language. It's the universal language. How do you usually eat your lamb? On a kebab with chili and garlic sauce. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the intestines coming next. Am I nervous? Am I nervous? Not really, to be honest. I don't find that too quirky on the list of quirkiness. I've eaten the feet, this, that. Heads, <laughs> heads, hey, and dried squid. And... So I don't reckon, I'm um, Jade, let's see what it is. I'm sure it'll be covered in chili, so let's oge. Oh, it depends in the format that it's arrived. So like, I haven't even judged it yet. If it comes and it's like, just looks like chopped meat, then I'm eight. But if it comes and it's like, if it's just fine, I'll be like, ah, what is that? Ooh, <laughs> that's sus. All right, I was hoping it didn't look like an intestine, but it does. As you can see, there's the intestine, there's the esophagus, there's the fourth anus. I want to try to find a piece that has less resemblance to an intestine. Like that. Bean sprouts, mix it in with beans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. What is it like? Like, what? before I bite it, what is it like? Is it like meat? Is it like cartilage? It's not like meat? Fuck. Forgive me if I spit this, all right? I 
are. I'm having a ment mental war here, <laughs> right? A bit of self-talk. If I didn't know that that was intestines, it would be completely normal. Just tastes like you're chewing on a little bit of a fat. But the fact that you know, it throws you off a bit. The taste though, hectic. This is the hottest dish so far. But this is if you eat too much, you're having a bad day tomorrow. It's still in your mouth? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be having another bite of that, <laughs> all right? <laughs> but that's a beautiful dish. It's just straight intestines, eh? Mm -hmm. I'll save that for the old Chinese fellas, eh? We've got roasted uh, brain as well. It has to. But yeah. I won't even eat it because I just it, it's a brain. It looks like a brain. From what animal? Whoa, that's even worse. Mm. That's the scariest of all brains. <laughs> Oh, that's beautiful. What exactly is Kung Pao? It was always about the same noodles in jail, and then like the governor must have got fancy and gave us some new flavors, and one of them was spicy Kung Pao. And like everyone loved them, and like, bruh, get them Kung Pao noodles, lad. And here we go. We live in my old silver water days. That's Oge. Is this I sweet? Say this is chili. Oh, a little bit. Sweet, yeah, yeah. yeah. Looks like I'm um, like honey prawn, you know? Yeah. It doesn't taste like honey prawn. Ooh. That's mad. I don't know how to articulate that. I thought it was gonna be sweet, you know what I mean? You know, one of those like, whoa, like full sugary ones. It's not like that at all. It's just the color throws you off. It has like a nutty flavor. That's nice. There's brain coming. The brain's coming. This is a whole nother level, by the way. It's a, it's a pork brain. It's a pig's brain. Come on, man. <laughs> pig's brain, he eating pig's brains. Why? I don't know why. A <laughs> big YouTube eating pig's brains. Let's go. You know, I wouldn't even eat this. You won't eat it? No, I wouldn't eat it. Right. Uh... What? No way. <laughs> Can you do it? Yeah, I'll do it. 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 Let's go. I'm gonna copy. You'll this. actually try it? I'm gonna try it. Of wow. course I'm gonna try it. Oh, 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 It's got the texture of a brain. Yeah. I don't know. A pig's brain, eh? Bro. What do they love about it? What do they what do they compare it to? When they when they're trying to verbal ya yeah? and they're like, rice, just try it. It tastes like what do they say? Brain. No <laughs> way. Oh. It's like um it's not that bad. Don't get me wrong, I'm not gonna <laughs> eat it. It's a brain, right? It ends there. But you know what? I'm gonna have one more bite. The sauce is actually gone. Let me take a bit of that veggie. It has the, the texture of like a cream puff. <laughs> a cream puff. It's like a cream puff. It's like, like a marshmallow. Like a spicy, savory marshmallow. The intestines, it's better than the intestines. Really? It's better than the intestines. If you eat the intestines, oh, you need to, you need to eat, yeah. eat it. No, right. Eat it. Come on. I'm nah. <laughs> Like I said, it's like a marshmallow. So when you know it's part of an animal and it's soft as a marshmallow, of course it's gonna wig you out. I would rather it's soft like a marshmallow and it dissolves in your mouth, has a nice flavor, than like the intestines is just like full chewy. Like 10 minutes later, it's there and you're spewing and you're just like, oh, bro, I gotta swallow this. Smells like, like a barbecue. <laughs> it smells like a barbecue, it just smells like any other meat. It smells like a barbecue, it's nice. It's sort of like meat. Yeah, it looks like meat. Yeah, it's weird. Actually like me. One day if all brains are like that. Succulent meaty marshmallows. Hey Rice, thank you, eh? Thanks for having me. Thank you so much. Very generous. Hey, um, so where are these places? So, so people can go? One in Haymarket. Yep, Sydney. that's this one. We've got one in Chatswood. Mm -hmm. We've got one in Burwood, and then we've got one in Rhodes. Rhodes is a hot pot place, just as good. Rhodes is hot or hot pots. Hot oh beautiful. Mm -hmm. Alright, thank you, eh? Thank Loved you so much it. Later. Alright, everyone. That's our spicy joint haymarket. Traditional North Chinese, Sichuan, Chinese food. Um, what do I think about it? The biggest thing that I can say out of that is that it is full unique. There's not a single thing there that I would expect. If you gave me those dishes and, you, and I wasn't sitting in a Chinese restaurant, 
and you said like, where do I think they're from? There's no way in the world I would have said they're Chinese. It's spicy joint. So be prepared for chili. Everything is covered in chili. I copped it, to, to be honest, nothing really burnt my mouth. But a lot of these, if you come to these places like, and you're chili amateurs, it'll bomb ya. Never had that type of food before? Yeah, it's nice, eh? Sejuan. Sejuan means it's a code word for chili explosions. Let's oge.